Simpkins and welcome to The Fumble. Huge fight weekend and we're bringing you the highlights. Former UFC champ John Jones made his long-awaited return to the Octagon Saturday night in Vegas. In his first fight back, Jones defeated Ovince St. Pru by unanimous decision. Jones was stripped of his title and suspended in 2015 for a felony hit and run that resulted in 18 months of probation. Now Jones and St. Prue fought standing for the first three rounds, Jones staying aggressive and throwing body kicks and side kicks. But in the fourth and fifth round, Jones took St. Prue to the ground and started dropping hard elbows and punches. After the fight, Jones was taken backstage in a wheelchair and Dana White said St. Prue had a broken arm and was taken to the hospital. Technically, Jones was crowned the interim champion Saturday night, but when they tried to give him the belt, he declined it saying, it's not the right belt. Thank you so much. Hey, it, I don't think I want that belt. It's not the real belt. I want, my, uh, I want my actual belt back. Jones is really after the light heavyweight title that was stripped from him after his felony. Daniel Cormier currently holds that belt and was supposed to have a title fight with Jones in UFC 197, but had to pull out due to injury. Dana White just said the Jones-Cormier fight could be the new replacement headliner for UFC 200 in July. The original headliner was supposed to be between Conor McGregor and Nate Diaz, but as of now, they're both out. Connor was pulled off the card for refusing to do press, and Diaz said he has no interest in fighting unless it's against McGregor. For more sports news, visit us at obsev.com slash the fumble, and don't forget to hit subscribe before you go.